Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be solving Cambridge IGCC Information and Communication Technology Paper 2 for February March 2024. I'm going to do the presentation task, which is task 4. The other tasks are done and uploaded. You can find the link in the description. Create a presentation of 8 slides using the file safety.rtf. So for the presentation, I'll be using Microsoft PowerPoint. Open a blank presentation. Now let's import the file. Go to new slide, slides from outline. Select your folder, safety.rtf. So select this file, insert. There will be a blank slide here. You can remove that. Use the master slide to display only the following features. Automatic slide numbers on the top left. So let's go to the master slide. View. Slide master. Make sure you select the topmost slide while editing the master slide. Let's remove these text boxes. And add them whenever required. So automatic slide numbers should be on the top left. So insert a text box on the top left. And keep your cursor inside. Go to insert slide number. You can see the option slide number here. The company logo, logo.jpg position on the top right. Insert picture, go to your folder, the logo, insert. It should be on the top right. Make sure it does not overlap any of this. Your name, sender number, and candidate number. So let's give the name, sender number, and candidate number in the bottom left. Make sure master slide items appear in the same position on every slide. No items should overlap. So the master slide is done. You can go back to the normal view, view normal. Format slide one so that a title slide layout is supplied with new bullets. A title and subtitle text are central aligned in the middle of the slide. So this is slide one, right click, go to layout and select title slide. So automatically the title and subtitle are central aligned here. Delete the slides with the title Gaming Benefits and Negative Effects of Game. Gaming Benefits is slide 3. So we have to delete slide 3 and 4. So now we have six slides. Data in ratings.csv to create a vertical bar chart to show the number of ratings given to each age category in 2023 only. Display the with labels age categories on category axis and number of games on the value axis. So this is the required file. For each age category, we have to show the ratings only for 2023. So select the age category. Make sure this total is not selected and also this values. This is the year, so don't select that. The values for 2023 and the age categories. 
go to insert a vertical bar chart. Do not display a legend. The chart title should be Rating of Games in 2023. There is no legend. So, chart title is Rating of Games in 2023. And we have to add Category Access Title as the Age Category. So, add Access Titles. So, this is the Category Access Title. Display only the data values along the top of each bar. This you can remove. Select the bars, then click here and give data labels. So the values are displayed on the top of the bar. Format the value axis to display a minimum value of 0, maximum value of 560 and increments of 70. So select the axis, right click. Format axis. So minimum value should be 0, maximum should be 560, and increments is 70. So the major you have to make it 70. So that is done. Place the chart to the left of the bullets on the slide with the title game ratings. So let's copy the chart. It should be placed to the left of the bullets. So this is the slide, slide four. So bring the bullets to the right. Now let's paste the chart here. Make sure no words in the chart are split. All data and labels are fully visible. The chart and its contents do not overlap any slide items. So everything is fine here. On the slide with the title Game Ratings, format the text Age Classification. So when clicked, it opens the document, the file name categories.csv. So Age Classifications. So we have age classifications here. Select this text, right click. We have to hyperlink, so click on link. And it should be linked to select your folder here. It should be linked to categories.csv so categories.csv take a screenshot to show that the text links to the correct file place this in your evidence document so this window screenshot you need to take This is step 27 evidence. So this is the required screenshot. You OK. Next, add the following text as presenter notes to the slide with the title Game Ratings. So this text has to be added as presenter notes. So here you can see notes option. If you click on notes option, we can see click to add notes. So here you can add the notes. Print only this slide as presenter notes. So only this slide has to be printed as presenter notes. For that go to file, print. You need to select the notes pages. So we'll click on notes pages so that the slide along with the presenter notes will be printed. Make sure your name is given in the header or footer for the examination purpose. Give your name, center number and candidate number in the header. 
So this is the first printout required. Save the presentation. Print slides 1, 2, 3 and 4 only as handouts in portrait orientation with two slides on each page and each side filling half the page. So in order to print only one, two, three, four, go to five, print, give one to four, and it should be two slides per page. So only the first four slides will be printed. So this is the required printout. This is the end of the presentation task. Thank you for now.